So this plant here is wild ginger, a serum canadense. Let's see if I can get this flower. It flowers underneath the leaf. Um, it's kind of a pretty flower, but you don't really see it because it's underneath the, you know, the leaves. Um, it's zones four to six, and it can get up to a foot tall, and it's basically used as a ground cover. It'll spread around and seed itself and stuff, so you're kind of hoping that it'll, you know, work this area. I got another one right there. Um, takes part shade to shade and a medium to wet soil and it blooms today's May 2nd so late April early May uh, it is not related to the culinary ginger uh, it might be edible but don't quote me on that I do not know um, one book that I read did say that the early Americans used to use it as a ginger substitute. And um, in, a, in a butterfly book that I read, uh, Learn About Butterflies in the Garden, uh, it says that the pipe vine swallowtail caterpillar will use this plant as a host. Uh, I have not seen it, but that's what the book says. So that's it for this plant, wild ginger, a serum canadense.